Hello guys, welcome to part 4 and likely the conclusion of Let's Play Kindle Rage, brought to you by Gaming1.com, time for the final boss. Joe, 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 I might have to keep you after school. Wait, wait a minute, you're the principal! Wait a minute. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! This is the final boss! All you have to do is just stand right next to him! Whack away! And you win! Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute! Uh, now I'm mad! I'll teach you a lesson, Josephine! Okay, good, there's another phase! This one might be slightly easier! Pretty cheery music for a final boss. I mean, all you gotta do is just dodge the teeth. There, it's over. I see I'll have to suspend you from Kendo School forever. No, wait, it's not over yet. Okay, this one is slightly harder. It is slightly harder. What happens if you get a game over? Okay, you gotta continue. I mean, that's nice, but I'm not starting that entire boss rush over. I'm sorry. Oh, so much for actually thinking I can just spam damage this bitch. It is the final boss after all, so it's likely to do way too much damage. Point of no return now. Oh, I hate that attack so much. I gotta get over here and jump it that way. Okay, that one I wasn't expecting. Okay, here I was thinking this was gonna be the easiest final boss of all final bosses. And it actually has three phases. And this one's pissing me off the most. Cause right now I can I cannot take any more than one hit. Okay, that one is timed it on purpose. I, I hate the no. What? What? Oh, infinite loop. I made a bad save. But there's no way I can dodge that. That means I have to do the whole boss rush over. Be right back. Going through all of that again. This time I came in here with a full load of lives. And some extra insurance, so now I don't have to worry too much about making any bad saves. I can just go in there and wail on him now. Since I got enough lives. But yeah, he still pisses me off. That's the worst principle ever. There we go. So that makes me principal of Kendo School. Learn anything? Yep, never trust a green-haired Japanese guy named Bob. And I'm guessing that just tells you the final score. Yeah, that's it. That's 
Kendo Rage for the Super Nintendo, big squirt. <laughs> really nice they give you the character runs so you can see all these goofy names. Especially Blue Bear. So yeah, stay tuned for more of Final Fantasy 1 in the days to come because I still got a lot to do. So this is the Banga signing off saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play, which will obviously see more Final Fantasy 1. But I might throw in a surprise. Let's watch the rest of this ending. No one likes Smart Alec Joe. No, they don't. Actually, Goodbye. before I go, why don't I actually show you the opening intro of the game that I skipped? Hi, I'm Joe, short, short for Josephine Yuck. I love matrial uh, arts, especially Kendo. So it was like totally cool when my parents decided to send me to Japan for my summer vacation. I was so lucky to get them sent to the Anasasaki's Kendo School and used car sales. Imagine learning from one of Japan's great kendo masters. So yeah, I can't believe they misspelled that. Sorry, see everyone.